For more videos visit forthesakeofeducation.com Alright guys, now we're gonna do this problem that says determine the resultant force at A. So basically you have two forces FB and FC that act along AB and AC and we're gonna form the Cartesian vector form of those forces and add them together. So first you need to find all the points involved. So you got the position of A which sits at 2i plus 0j plus 6k the position of B which sits at 0i plus 4j plus 2k the position of C which sits at negative 4i and the position vector C which sits at negative 4i plus 3j plus 4k so the first vector AB you can find it by subtracting vector A from vector B and you get it to be negative 2i plus 4j minus 4k now that you have the Cartesian ve uh, vector form of vector AB you can find its magnitude by doing the square root of the x component square plus the y component square plus the c component square once you plug in these three numbers onto this formula you're gonna get that the magnitude is 6 now if you divide the vector AB by its magnitude you can find the univector AB the univector comes out to be negative 0 0.333i plus 0.667j minus 0.667k now that you have the univector AB which is this vector right here you can multiply by the magnitude of f of b to find the Cartesian vector form of f of b so the magnitude times the univector along AB will give you the Cartesian vector form of FB which comes out to be negative 200i plus 400j minus 400k now we're gonna repeat the same steps but for vector F, uh, AC is found by subtracting vector A from vector C and it comes out to be negative 6 i plus 3j minus 2k the magnitude comes out to be 7 and is found with the same formula and the univector along AC is found by dividing the vector AC by its magnitude and it comes out to be negative 0.857i plus 0.429j minus 0.286k now you know that the magnitude of f of c is 490 so the Cartesian vector form of f of c is found by multiplying its magnitude times a univector running along ac which is this tiny vector right here with a magnitude of 1 now the Cartesian vector form of c comes out to be negative 420i plus 210j minus 140k and the resultant force is found by adding f of c plus f of b so basically you add the x with the x the y with the y and the c with the c and you get f of r to be negative 620i plus 610j minus 540k final answer please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help thank you